My name is Farhat, I'm 12 years old, I am living in the refugee camp in Serbia. This is my room, she is my mom, he's my brother, Hello. and he's my another brother, my father. My family are from Afghanistan. <laughs> there was a war there, so I grew up in Iran. I remember the day when we were going away. I remember the door. My dad said we are going to a better country. We tried to go to the border three times, but the police caught us. The third time, we walked 12 hours through the mountains. I was very cold. We waited in the smuggler's house in Turkey for 15 days. We went to the beach. There was a big boat and a lot of people getting on. They told us the boat is too heavy. People had to throw the things in the water. I had my coloring pencils and brushes with me. I threw them over the side. I woke up at 7. We had arrived in Greece. We sleep outside many times, trying to cross the borders. When we got to the refugees camp in Serbia, we told the smuggler we didn't want to go anywhere further. We live here now. Every two seconds, someone in the wild is forced to abandon their home because it's no longer safe for them to stay there. The journeys they go on can be long and very dangerous, and the places they end up living, like refugee camps, can be very hard and uncertain places to grow up in. But there is a project in Serbia helping children who are refugees to feel more at home, and it's being supported by Comic Relief. My friends told me that there is an organization that they help refugees. They give me pencil, paper, and everything to draw. I just draw something for them, and they say it's very good. I was going there almost every day. I want to be the best football player and artist in the world. Get involved with your school this Red Nose Day and you can help children like Farhad stay safe when they're on the move and keep their dreams alive wherever they end up calling home. <laughs>